Hello everyone. Here we are going to continue with the exercise 18.2 of the chapter mensuration. We have already did till question number 12 in our previous video. Now let's do question number 13. Now here in question number 13 we have the top surface of a raised platform is in the shape of a regular octagon as shown in the adjoining figure. Here we have to find the area of octagonal surface. Now here we are having this figure which is a regular octagon. Regular octagon means all of the sides are of equal length. So if this one is 8 meter then all of them will be of 8 meter. Then we are going to join this two points and we are going to divide this whole octagon into three parts that is first trapezium, second rectangle and the third again trapezium and we are going to name it as A, B, C, D, E, F, G, and h then we are going to find the area of the trapezium a b c d then a rectangle a d e h and a trapezium h g f e then we are going to add all of the three to get the area of whole octagon so very first of all we are going to find the area of trapezium a b c d now we know the area of trapezium a b c d is half into sum of palisades into height so this is one upon two into sum of palisade that is BC plus AD into height then this will be equals to 1 upon 2 into BC is 8 centimeter as it is a regular polygon plus this is of 15 centimeter 15 meter so this into 6 meter so here 2 can cancel out this 6 to get 3 so 8 plus 15 we are having 23 into 3 that is equals to 69 meter square now we have got the area of triple a b c d which is of 69 meter square now we know that this was 8 meter and this is also of 8 meter here this is 15 meter so this is also of 15 meter the height is 6 so the height of this one is also 6 so the units of both of the trapezium are, are same therefore the area of this trapezium will be also 69 meter square so the area of trapezium EFGH is also equal to 69 meter square. Now we are going to find the area of rectangle AHED. And here area of rectangle AHDE equals to length into breadth. That is equal to AD into AH. That is 15 into 8. And this is equal to 120 meter square. Now to get the area of whole octagon, we are going to add all of the three areas. And here the area of octagon equals to the sum of 69, 69 and 120. So here 69 plus 69 plus 120. That is equals to 258 meter square as answer. Now let's see question number 14. Here we have in the adjoining figure ABCD is a rectangle of the size 18 cm by 10 cm. In triangle BEC angle is 90 degree and EC is of 8 cm. Find the area enclosed by the pentagon ABECD. Now here in this question we have to find the area of this shaded region. So very first of all we are going to use this triangle that is triangle ECB. Here we are having 90 degree angle. Therefore, this one is a right angle triangle. So we can apply Pythagoras theorem to find out this side BE. So here in triangle BEC by Pythagoras theorem we get BC square equals to BE square plus CE square. And that is BC we are having 10 square equals to BE we have to calculate plus CE we are having 8 square that implies BE square equals to 10 square minus 8 square that is 100 minus 64 and this will be equal to 36 that implies BE equals to the root of 36 that is equal to 6 centimeter. Now we have got the length of this BE so with the help of this and this side we can calculate the area of this triangle BEC. So area of triangle BEC equals to 1 upon 2 into base we can take BE and the height we can take CE. And here we get 1 upon 2 into BE we have just calculated as 6 
and CE we have got 8. Now 2, 4 times, so this is 6 into 4, 24 centimeter square. Now after getting the area of triangle BEC as 24 centimeter square, now we are going to calculate the area of rectangle ABCD. And area of rectangle ABCD is length into breadth. So here we will be taking AB into BC. That is 18 into 10 and that is equals to 180 centimeter square. Now after getting the area of rectangle and area of triangle, we can calculate the area of the shaded region by subtracting the area of triangle from the area of rectangle. So here the area of pentagon A B E C D that is this shaded region will be equal to the area of rectangle minus area of triangle. So here we get 180 minus 24 and this is equal to 156 centimeter square as answer. Now let's move to question number 15. Here we are having this polygon and we have to find the area of this whole polygon. This polygon is divided into 1, 2, 3 and 4 triangles and 1 trapezium. So very first of all we see which length are being given to us. So here we are having the length of AF as 3 cm, AG we are having 4 cm and AH we are having 6 cm and this AD we have got 8 cm. Now this AD will help us to get the area of triangle AED. This triangle ka area we can get out of the AFB ka bhi area hum nikal sakte because we are having the length of this AF that is of 3 cm. Now for this trapezium we are having the length of parallel side that is 2 cm and 3 cm respectively but this height is not given us directly. We have been given the length of this A H as 6 cm. Now this AH is 6 cm and AF is 3 cm. This means the AFH will be equals to 6 minus 3 that is of 3 cm only. Then we are having this triangle CHD. In this one also we are having this height but we are not been given with this HD. So HD nikalne ke liye, we are going to subtract this 8 by 6. Because यहाँ से यहाँ तक की पूरी length हमें eight दिया है और यहाँ से यहाँ तक का six दिया है, so eight minus six will be giving you two centimeter. So the length of HD is of two centimeter, and this triangle can be calculated with the whole base and this height. Now we are going to calculate the area of triangle ABF, and here we have the area of triangle ABF as one upon two into base. We can take AF into height will be BF that is equals to 1 upon 2 A of we are having 3 into height we are having 2. This is going to cancel it out to give 3 centimeter square as the area. Now we are going to calculate the area of trapezium BFHC and the area of trapezium BFHC will be half the sum of palisades into height. So here we have 1 upon 2 into palisades we are having FB plus the other one is HC into height and this is 1 upon 2 into 2 plus 3 into this height as 3 that is 3 over here so 1 upon 2 into 5 into 3 and this is equals to 15 upon 2 that is equals to 7.5 centimeter square then we are having the area of triangle CHD and here the area of triangle CHD equals to 1 upon 2 into base into height and this is HD into CH that is equals to 1 upon 2 into HD we have got 2 and CH we are having 3. So 2 is going to cancel out to give 1 and this 3 centimeter square as area. Then we have to calculate the area of triangle AED and here area of triangle AED equals to 1 upon 2 base we are going to take AD so AD into height we are having GE. Now this is equal to 1 upon 2 into AD. We have got the full length that is of 8 centimeter. So 8 into GE we have got 2.5. And this 2 is going to cancel out to get 4. And 4 into 2.5 is 10 centimeter square. Now to get the area of whole polygon we are going to add all of the areas. So area of polygon A, B, C, D, E equals to 3 plus 
plus 3 plus this will 10 centimeter square and the sum of all of this will be 23.5 centimeter square as answer. Now let's move to question number 16 and here we have got this figure and we have to find the area of this whole polygon. This polygon is divided into 1, 2, 3 and 4 triangles and 2 trapezium. Now we have been given the length of this PS as 11 cm, then PY as 9 cm, PX is given as 8 cm, PW we are having 5 cm and PV we are having 3 cm. Then the height Q, V we are having 5 cm, R, X we are having 6 cm, T, Y is 2 cm and U, W is 4 cm. So we are having all the height and for the trapezium we are having the parallel sides. Now very first of all we are going to find all of this bases. So P, V we have got 3 cm. This can be easily done from here. Then we have to get the value of p w that is also given to us as 5 cm. So here also we have got 5 that will be the complete for this triangle and this triangle. Now for this trapezium, this trapezium ke liye we are having p x, p x ki puri length humare paas hai 8 cm aur yaha se yaha te kilen in p v, we are having 3 cm. So jab 8 me se 3 subtract karenge then we will be getting the length of this w, sorry v and x that is of 8 minus 3 that is 5 centimeter. So, ye ho gaya, 5 centimeter. Then to get the length of w and y, we are going to subtract py minus pw. So, py ki value humare paas hai 9 centimeter. So, 9 minus 5 that is of 4 centimeter. So, is trapezium ke liye height ho jayega 4 centimeter. Now, we have to find the length of xs. So, humare paas puri length yani py hume diya hua hai 11 centimeter. And px we have got 8 centimeter. So 11 minus 8 that is of 3 centimeter ki is ki height ho gai. Then the ys. Ys may be hum is 11 ka use karenge aur py ki length ko is me se subtract karenge. So 11 minus 9 that is of 2 centimeter. So here we have got all the length to be get from the figure. Now we are going to calculate the area of triangle pvq. And here the area of triangle pvq we are having 1 upon 2 into base pv into height q v and here we get 1 upon 2 into 3 into 5 that is equals to 15 upon 2 and this will be 7.5 centimeter square then we are going to calculate the area of triangle p w u and here the area of triangle p w u equals to 1 upon 2 into base we can take p w into height will be w u and here it is 1 upon 2 into 5 into 4. So 5 into 4. This 2 is going to cancel out to get 2. And this is equal to 10 centimeter square. Now let's calculate the area of triangle RXS. And area of triangle RXS equals to 1 upon 2 into base. We can take XS into height will be RX. And this is equal to 1 upon 2 into XS is 3 into height we are having 6. This is going to cancel to get 3 that is equal to 9 centimeter square. Now we will be calculating the area of triangle TYS. Now the area of triangle TYS equals to 1 upon 2 into base we can take YS. So YS into height will be YT that is equal to 1 upon 2 into YS is 2 and this is a gain of 2. So 2 we are going to cancel it out to get 1 and here we get 2 centimeter square as the area of triangle TYS. So here we have got all the areas of triangles then we are moving for the trapezium. So the area of trapezium Q, V, X, R. So here the area of trapezium Q, V, X, R we are having 1 upon 2 into sum of palace sides that is Q, V plus R, X into height. And here we have 1 upon 2 into sum of palace sides is 5 and 6. So 5 plus 6 into height will be of 5. So this is equal to 1 upon 2 into 5 plus 6 that is 11 into 5. That is equal to 55 upon 2 and this will be 27.5 centimeter square. Then we are moving for the trapezium U, 
W Y T. An area of trapezium U W Y T equals to one upon two into W U plus Y T into height, and this is one upon two into four plus two into height. We have got four centimeter over here. So four. This is going to cancel. It to be up to, and this will be. 6 into 2 that is equal to 12 cm square now we've got the area of both of the trapezium and to get the area of whole polygon we are going to add all of the six areas and here the area of polygon equals to 7.5 plus 10 plus 9 plus 2 plus 27.5 plus 12 and that is equals to 68 cm square as answer that's all for this video Thank you.